hey guys so welcome back to wp event manager and in today's video i'm gonna show you another child theme demo uh it will be related to dj or party okay uh of course you will need the wp event managers event listing theme uh, to get started and one more plugin that we have already talked about that will be the one click demo importer let me show you what that uh, plugin is in the plugin store itself so you can install it for yourself uh over here you have to type in a uh, one click demo importer i'm gonna leave the link in the description you can copy it from there um, search it and install it for yourself uh when you have installed and activated the theme uh and the plugin the one click demo import plugin make sure you install elementor as well that will be uh, necessary for the next steps we're gonna do okay not the pro version uh you don't need pro version if you have that's great but uh the paid version will sorry the free version will work just fine uh, so let's get started uh, when you have installed and activated the plugin itself the one click demo import you have to go to the appearance then import demo data okay over here you'll be able to see the active theme in this scenario that will be the event listing and if you scroll down you will be able to find all the uh, available demo data or like child themes uh, over here in this list okay so all you have to do over here you can Go ahead and like take a demo if you want it will take you to our demo website uh you can experience the full uh, experience over there uh it, it will be a full-fledged site with the plugin and all the themes all the wp manager related plugins add-ons installed in there you can take a look at it like for yourself uh but how to import the data is pretty simple you have to click on this button and then it will run a pre-flight check uh, the required plugins are WPP Manager and Elementor. Like I said, the Elementor will come handy later on. Uh, any of the star marked plugins over here are not necessary, uh, but they're optional and suggested. If you want or like you would like to use one of them, you can just click on here. Now it will automatically install it in the process of demo import. Okay. So when you're done over here, you can click on continue and import. You have to wait for like some few seconds uh, it will go ahead and import automatically uh, everything demo data the theme and even like some uh, sample events for you to try out so when it's done we're gonna take a look at the site itself now we can go ahead and see the site so if you give a click on the visit site it will take you to the home page itself uh, there is some post installation step that you will have to uh, follow to make uh, the experience much similar uh, to what you have previewed over here you'll be able to see like it's using a boxed layout like the default template over here in the front page uh, it's very easy to solve all you have to do is click on edit page but before that another step like which you have, have maybe have to like do that is rearranging this menu so i'm gonna show you how to rearrange the menu later on when we go to the customizer section but first let's fix the layout problem over here uh, you have to go to edit page and over here you can change it to uh, elementor full width okay under the template section and click on update and if you open the site again you will see uh, it will be like properly aligned okay like like this so let's take a look at the theme first then we're gonna go to customizer and show you what options we have available there again uh, you can go to uh, like the demo site to take a look at the full uh, experience over there it will be a full flesh site so this theme is targeted more towards um, a dj party type of scenario uh, everything is customizable what you see over here in this page itself so let me show you how you can do that uh, all you have to do is click on edit with elementor and then over here you'll be able to customize every aspect of the template okay so over here you'll be able to see like everything is designed with elementor you can drag and drop or click and edit anything in this page uh, you can remove something you can edit you can add certain elements if you want everything is customizable in this page uh, when you are done all you have to do is click on this update button over here it will update your page right away and the changes will be available instantly so let's go ahead and exit the elementor and uh, let me show you what customization options we have enabled so we're gonna go back to our site and we're gonna load up the customizer so wp even managers even listing theme uh, it will be uh, 
firstly customizable that you can like explore from here so site identity menu widget these are global uh, but we have certain aspect of our own uh, magic over here uh, like i was saying how to readjust the menus if you want uh, over here you can come to menus okay uh, you can choose which menu you want to like select okay and then you can uh, select that menu and set it to primary it will appear over here like if i want to do this i can do that it will like rearrange my menu like basically like creating a new menu or maybe assigning your own menu to as a primary menu over here in the header okay uh, i'm not gonna publish this since i'm gonna not use this menu but this is just for demo purpose you can also like add widgets to sidebar footer footer one footer two uh the footer section over here these columns are also customizable so how you can do that you can go to uh theme options uh site layout sorry uh, you can go to footer settings and over there you can select the widgets row over here whether you want to choose a four column layout whether you want to use like a three column or two column or one column uh, up to four column is available and you can also modify your copyright text from here uh, i'm not gonna go ahead and do that make your changes over here you can click on publish it will uh, go live instantly um yeah site layout settings over here you'll be able to select your default site layout full width or box layout so you get the idea uh whether to show sidebar by default or not by default it's not uh whether to show content at the top in mobile view or sidebar that's also customizable from here um let's go back to the header settings over here you can add like a top bar right here uh if you type in telephone number or an email it will show a top bar over here and if you want to show like a search bar or like such icon in your uh, menu section you can also check on this box it will show a search icon over here uh, shortly okay like that and you can show social icons but to like make social icon works you will first have to add a menu that has social links on it so i'm not going to go ahead and do that but feel free to do it you can go to menus add your social links assign it to social menu and if you turn on the show social icons uh, it will appear over here just fine all right so that's pretty much covers up the entire aspect of the customizer uh all also like if you want to uh, add additional css to customize the site globally you can do that over here uh you can like add woocommerce related stuffs over here because our wp manager event listing theme plays nicely with woocommerce we followed the storefront uh, general practice so yeah apart from like normal things like uh, colors header image typography these are the available options and if in any case you want to go back to the parent theme or like the base theme or uh, wanting to omit the uh, custom uh, styling that comes with the uh, demo data you can do that from the customizer itself there will be a reset button where you can uh, click on reset and the imported child theme will disappear okay you will be able to use the base uh, or like the original event listing stylings uh, i hope that gave you a bit of insight about the plugin and the theme itself let me know in the comment if you have any kind of confusion i'll be sure to help you out in there and until next time, I'm Shara saying goodbye. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.